If you're looking for a cheap and reliable Minecraft server, head over to servermine.com and use the link in the description for 10% off your first month with them. Hello and welcome to my 24th mod installation video. Today I'll be showing you how to install the Journey Map mod for Minecraft. So the first thing we're going to do is head over to our Minecraft launcher and we're going to launch the game in the version that we want to install the mod on. So for me, I want to install the Journey Map mod for Minecraft 1.8.9. So that's the version I will launch the game in. So go edit profile, select the version you want to install the mod on, save profile and then play. Uh, this, is, this is just making sure we have the version files on our computer before we try to install the mod. Once it's launched up, just close it down and then head over to the download page for the Journey Map mod. The link for this is in the description below. Once on the Journey Map Mods download page, we can then select the version of the mod we want to install. So come over to Other Downloads and this is all the versions that you can download. Um, the latest one is here on the right hand corner of the page where you have the orange download button. I'm going to click that for 1.8.9 but if you want to install a 1.8.8 version or lower, you can come down here, select the file and download it. So I'm downloading 1.8.9 which is the latest so I can just click the orange download button which is here. You'll be taken to this page here, wait for it to count down 3 seconds. We'll begin downloading, just click keep and now we're going to go back, just click this little back arrow here and it will take us back to the journey map um, main page and then we're going to click on changes and now in here we can see the requirements, it then has the required version of Forge. Um, if you cannot find a required version um, of Forge for your mod uh, so I'm downloading 1.8.9. When you are on the Minecraft Forge download page, just download the recommended version of Forge for the version you're installing uh, the Journey Map mod on. So just select uh, any one you want. So say you're doing for 1.7, select 1.7, then download the recommended installer, but I'm 1.8.9, which is selected. So I just come down to the download recommended installer, click on that. You'll be taken to a page that looks a bit like AdFly if you know what that page is. Wait for it to count down 6 seconds at the top right hand corner of the screen. Once it's done just click skip add and it will begin downloading. Once they're done just drag the journey map mod and minecraft forge out of your downloads and onto your desktop. We're now going to open up minecraft forge that we just downloaded. Make sure it has clicked install the client and then hit OK. We'll begin downloading, successfully installed client profile forge, hit OK and then we're going to go back to our Minecraft launcher. Click on edit profile and we're going to select the version 1. Point whatever, whatever version you're using, then forge, so mine's 1.8.9 forge. Click save, make sure it has it down here, ready to play Minecraft Forge. Then just hit play and it'll begin downloading the Minecraft Forge file such as the mods folder and all that that will be we that we'll will be using later. Once it's launched, just close it down. Then head over to your search bar, wherever that is for you, whatever version of Windows you're using. I want to search percent app data percent. Hit enter. Look for the folder called .minecraft, and then look for a folder called mods. If you don't have one, you can just create one M O D S or lowercase. Now, once in here, you'll probably see no folders. I want you to create a folder and name it. Uh, for me, it's 1.8.9. You'll create it for whatever version you're installing the mod on. So if you're 1.9, uh, just make the folder 1.9. And then we're going to drag the journey map mod inside here. And then just double check it is inside the right folder. Once you've done that, you can close down this and then reopen the Minecraft launcher. Make sure it has ready to play Minecraft Forge again. Hit play. And now that it's launched, you can see this mods tab, you can click on it, 
You can look at all the mods you have installed. There is the journey map mod. I can then hit done. Single player, and I'll show you that it is working. So as you can see, the mod has successfully installed. I do have the minimap here. Uh, as you can see, it is Minecraft 1.8.9 at the top left hand corner here. And if I hit J, it opens up the larger map where I do have all the settings, um, actions, options, UIA theme, show mobs, show animals, show pets, show villages, all these different settings. Um, it really is a large mod. Uh, it's very fun to play with. In the future, I will do a mod spotlight on how to use it because it can be very confusing for someone that has just installed the mod and never used it before. So yeah, keep your eyes out for a mod spotlight. Uh, I'll try to upload one in the very near future. Um, so yeah, that's it for this video guys. If you enjoyed it or if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, drop a comment below and subscribe because it really helps. If you need help with this, please drop a comment below as well or add me on Skype. Um, Skype name is in the description below and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. So that's it guys. Thanks for watching. Once again, I'm Feathered Gaming. Goodbye. So I'm just going to go into my inventory, search up Lucky Block Mod. As you can see, I have the Lucky Block, Unlucky Block, and Very Lucky Block. I can put them in my inventory. I can place them all.